All right, my Buhai squad. Now we're having lunch, but you won't guess where we're having lunch. Check it out. Bahai Ligaya, <laughs> Filipino restaurant. That is so funny. Ligaya, we're eating at your restaurant. Oh, what a restaurant, guys. We're having lunch here. Wow, very traditional Filipino place. Oh my gosh, that's an Oryx. <gasps> Ligaya, this is your restaurant. <laughs> Which is what is this Pomelo. called? Pomelo. Pomelo in English. It's kind of like a giant grapefruit. Mmm. 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 Similar to a grapefruit, a little drier, but kind of less bitter than grapefruit. Delicious. Green mango shake. What is yours? Guyabano. Guyabano shake. Oh, here it is. Pinakbet Ilocano. Pinakbet, which is like a vegetable stew. Yum. Dinangdong. <gasps> Dinangdong. Mm. And my favorite, adobong pusit, squid adobo. Mmm. Mmm. Adobong pusit. Mmm. Mmm. Oh, yummy squid ink. Make my teeth black. Okra. In the pinak bed. Mmm. That pinnacle bread's good. See, it just explodes in your mouth. Oh my gosh. Look at all the vegetables in pinnacle bread. String beans, cigarillas, eggplant. Mm. 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 Guys, I've never had this. Dining ding. I've never had it. Let's try it. Is this Ilocano? Ibanang ding. We also do that. Okay, let's try it. Okra, oh yeah, okra, eggplant, saluyot, saluyot, some kind of leaves. I also see bitter board and palaya. Mmm, mmm. Oh yeah. Delicious. Mmm. Mmm, mmm, mmm. Wow. They usually put fish on top of the dining ding. Okay. Mmm, I love how vegetarian and like seafoodish lunches. We got tuna belly. Mmm. Oh wow. And there's the dipping sauce, onions, garlic, and soy sauce. Oh, look at that steaming tuna belly. Let's try it. Mmm. Mmm. Yum. Tuna belly, guys. Mmm, hot. Mmm, and so tasty. I need to have more. Guys, look at this tuna belly. Almost. There. I need it full. Sayang. Guys, look at that tuna belly. I'm contemplating eating the one that fell on the floor. Oh my god. Mmm. Mmm. Wow. Juicy fish protein. I'm gonna try dipping some of that sauce on it. Oh my god. Mmm. It just falls apart. We ended our vegetarian seafood streak. Crispy pata. Pork knuckle. 
Mmm, mm, guys, look at that delicious, tender pork knuckle. Oh, MG. Oh, look at how juicy. <gasps> it smells delicious, guys. I'm gonna also get some crispy skin. OMG. Look at that delicious skin and meat. Let's dip it. Mm. Mm. Guys, this skin is so good. I don't think it will be okay. I will have to have it. Mm. Mm. Let's try the meat. Mm. 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 So good. Mm. Mm. Mm -hmm. Wow. Killing me softly. <laughs> With his pork. Tita, what's your favorite here? Dineng Deng. The Dineng Deng. Yeah. Me too, it's really, really delicious. RJ, your favorite? Dineng yeah. Deng. You too? Yeah. Your favorite? Yeah. I miss it. Really? Wow. This Dineng Deng is a hit, guys. I yeah, basically love it too. just get anything like all like local Filipino vegetables and then you put little uh, um, bagoong. Oh. Fish paste, this shrimp paste. This is my first dineng deng in 30 years. Oh, really? Yeah, in Canada. I never tasted Oh, wow. I like the saluyot. Saluyot, the leaves. The leaves. Mm. It's the Filipino version of spinach. Filipino spinach, all right. Just woke up from an afternoon nap and she is loving these pellets. Now look at how smart she is. So she knows that she'll lose food through the grill. So she'll pick up the pellets and then she'll eat it either over the bowl or she'll bring it to like the blanket and eat it over the blanket so that it doesn't fall in the grill. Isn't that smart? Like see earlier, there's some pellets here. She was eating over here. I'm so happy you love these pellets, Ligaya. Trust me, you just make things so much easier for me. I was stressing. So guys, after some research, um, by the way, I forgot to mention this. Some surprising things that this parrots will eat include cooked human food. Some people feed actual like cooked food, pieces of cooked food, not a lot, to the birds. I really won't. Um, other snacks people offer these birds include chicken, like meat. Apparently you can give meat to parrots because parrots are apparently omnivorous. They're not just frugivorous, they're not just granivores, they're not any exclusively um, those foods. They eat meat as well. Um, some people offer their parrots chicken bones. Isn't that crazy? Um, that I found interesting. Another thing I found interesting was parrots can eat hot peppers. Yes, as in like spicy chili peppers, like in for Filipinos, sili. They can eat that. And I found that weird because um, I did see some dried hot peppers in her parrot mix. And I'm like, what's this doing here? I don't know, apparently par some parrots like spice. Isn't that crazy? I don't know if I'll ever try that with her, but it's just interesting to know. So right now, for those of you who are just joining us, um, Ligaya here has formula. Um, two to three times a day. She's in the transition of being weaned. Uh, I do want to free fly her eventually, so I don't want to wean her off the formula or at least feeding from a syringe right away. Um, but she also eats these awesome pellets, which are pretty nutritious. I don't have to do any guesswork, no adding of like vitamins and all of that. And she also eats a salad of like various vegetables and fruits. Oh yeah, and like she also has seeds and nuts, but that makes up the smallest portion of her diet because it's really fatty. It's essentially just a treat for now. Yes, she wants to play. Go poo, go poo. No, go poo first. Go poo, go poo. 
Okay, go eat and then go poo. <laughs> poo. Good girl. Yes, good girl. You did it. Good girl. So come, we can play now. Step up. Step up. Step up. Good girl. Yes. We shall play. Play on the couch. Your favorite play. The couch will always be her favorite stomping grounds. Good girl. Flap those wings. 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 Flap those. Flap those. Flap those wings. Flap those wings. Flap those wings. Flap those. Flap those. Flap those wings. Flap those wings. Flap those wings. Flap those. Flap those. Flap those wings. Guys, you know what I just realized? Legaya has full plumage. Wow. Like, none of that fluff is showing anymore. The down, a little bit of the down feathers are seen here, but that's it. Guys, she's got her full adult plumage now. Isn't that crazy? That's something to be excited about, isn't it, Legaya? You got your full plumage. Legaya, you're not a baby no more, right? She wants me to take her somewhere. Where do you want me to take you this time, hmm? Where? Where would you like to go, hmm? Hmm. Mm. Where? Hmm? Here, I'll turn it this way. Open palm. So I did the math, guys. And Legaya here is 10 weeks old. And like a, a day or two. Hmm. Yeah. Wow, full plumage. Amazing. Which means you're gonna fly soon. I don't know what I'm gonna do when you fly. Don't start flying anytime soon, all right? At least not until like your harness arrives. Mm hmm Yes, you have such nice plumage. Amazing feathers. Mm hmm And it's just gonna get even more beautiful from here. See, look at her chest. Even her chest is all full of adult feathers. Beautiful tail. Mm hmm it must be so itchy, all of those adult feathers coming in. Right? No, I'm not taking you to play. Go poo first. Go poo. Go poo. Go poo. Go poo. Go poo. Come on. Drinking water. I love that she's drinking. Go poo. Listen to the noises she's making. Go poo. 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 Good her guys. She's getting stronger and stronger with that beak and her neck. Like she can literally hang with just her beak. I've seen her do it. Look at her, she's trying to like grab onto the stick. Wow. Look at that flexibility. Seriously. <laughs> Looks like she's frustrated at that stick. What? Is the stick not lowering for you? She's really angry at that stick. Or either angry or just really happy with playing with it. The Gaia, go poo. Pick your armpit. Good girl. <laughs> at least she listens. Seriously guys, you see how long of a process this is? Waiting for her to poo in order to click and like to constantly say go poo. This is how the process goes and it takes a long time. Mm -hmm. But with consistency and like patience, she'll eventually get it. And I am determined to get her potty trained. Mm -hmm. Thank you guys for joining us on this journey of like training and bird development and socializing. It really means a lot to me. Look at how good Ligaya is at climbing now. So proficient. She climbs up to the top areas of the cage. I don't worry about her falling anymore. Seriously. Is she gonna climb up on that branch? I wonder. Climb, climb. Go, go, go. Go ahead, climb. All right. Get on top of the stick on the limb. She's playing with the foraging toy. I still don't think she realizes there's seeds in there, but she still loves playing with it. I can tell she wants to get down. Let's see how she gets down from here. 
Let's see if she's figured it out. Remember last time she really fell? Wow, she's really climbing high up on that branch. She's on a pretty steep, like, slope. Aha, to play with the apple toy. Come on, Nagaya, how are you gonna get down? How are you gonna get down from there? Okay, so she's holding on to the bridge. All right. Is she gonna cross the bridge? Oh, I think she's foraging for the seeds that I put in there. Smart girl. How are you gonna get off that branch? Hmm? Looks like she decided to sleep there. <laughs> she, she couldn't manage to step off the branch. So she slept there. <laughs> I'm sorry, Ligaya. Sorry, I didn't mean to laugh at you. You're just so funny. <laughs> Ligaya is so funny. I will take you down. I will feed you and then I will place you back on the ground. But you know what? She's like fully showing proficiency at like sleeping on that branch right now. She's never, I've never seen her sleeping perched. She's doing an adult bird thing right now. Right, Mabuhai Squad? Usually she's like sleeping on the floor like a, a chick does. But now she's sleeping like an adult parrot now. Man. She's growing up, Mabuhai Squad. She does something new every single day. Mabuhai Squad, our baby parrot is no longer a baby. Mm-hmm. But she will always be our baby, right, Mabuhai Squad? Mm-hmm. The Gaia wants some mango. Come on, mango. Come on, try it. She's like, I don't know how to eat that. Come on, here. Here. Yep. Just put it in your mouth. Stop dodging it. She's like, no, I don't want to eat it. Dinner time. Come on, step up. Good girl. So what I do now, it's our custom, is when I'm preparing her formula, I place her up on this perch. Go, oh, step down. Like so. No, 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 go, go, go. We've done this before. I put her on the perch so that she can watch me prepare her food, her formula. Yes, she loves it up here and she loves watching me prepare the food and she uses it as time to practice flapping those flappers flap those wings flap those wings why do you always stop when i start singing the cheer huh flap those wings see do it again flap those wings flap hey flap those wings ah oh, man are you self-conscious <laughs> teens all right let's make this food So guys, remember when she first was up here? Before she wouldn't come down on the grill, she was really scared and insecure. Now she's not. She fully walks on this grill now. You're so comfortable everywhere now. Soon you'll be able to have free roam of this place and I'll have to parrot proof. Okay, you wanna eat? Ready to eat? Here, step up, step up, step up. Good girl. Yep. It's dinner time. Yeah. She's like, finally, I see it sitting there on the table. <laughs> yes. Ooh, nice and warm for ya. Mmm. 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 Delicious, isn't it? All of that simulated parent barf. Look at all this delicious formula. Mmm. I wish someone would feed me some delicious formula. You know what I'm saying? Here, 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 here. Mmm. Come. Come. Are you like a teenager drinking from a baby's bottle? Like seriously. Shall this like formula feeding continue forever and ever? I'm just kidding. I don't mind. I love feeding you formula. It's very pleasurable for some reason. The day you stop eating formula is the day I get sad. Yes. And all this formula has so much vitamins and nutrients for you. Mm-hmm. The Mabuhai squad is so proud of how far you've come. As a bird, I'm proud. 
We are honored to be on this bird journey with you, Ligaya. Mm -hmm. Seriously, do you realize, Ligaya, that there are thousands of godparents out there, your godparents, your ninongs and ninongs, who um, love you and are watching you? They've watched you grow, you know what I'm saying? They, they want to see you grow into a proper parrot bird with manners. You have to be good. Gopu, good girl. Ah, my clicker's broken. No. I gotta get another clicker. She pooed. All right. Um, here. Here come. Oh, wait for your beak. Oh, don't go near there. Here, open. Mmm. 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 Yes. Yes. Mmm. Isn't this formula delicious? Mmm. But as I was saying, lots and lots of people out there who love watching you, Ligaya. Yes, lots of them are commenting. Yeah, oh, I should do a reading of comments, of your comments to her. Leave a comment in this video to Ligaya and I will read it out to her. Maybe she'll respond to you. Lots of people, yes. Ooh, oh, oh, oh. a lot. You got a little bit left. Let's make this count. Mmm. Mmm. Yes, yeah, swallow that. Swallow that. Are you done? Just a little bit more. Here, here, here. Or is your crop full? I think I think she's full. Okay, she's shying away from it. You're full. I get the message. Good girl. Yeah. Okay, okay. She's like, I wanna step up. I wanna leave now. Step up. Step up. Good girl, yes. Very good girl. I forgot to brush your beak. Wait, one more step. One more step required. We're not skipping steps here. You can't skip steps in life. If you skip steps, you skip success. You know what I'm saying? There, other side. Other side of your beak. You know how this goes. We've been doing this since you were a chick. But it's hard to do it with one hand. Wait, other side. <laughs> okay, I get the message. You're done. All right. Also, if you guys have any questions regarding the parrot, feel free to ask in the comments. I'll answer them either in a video or to your comments. Mm -hmm. Can I kiss? Thank you. <laughs> mm -hmm. So, by the way, her nails are extremely sharp. So, I only let her perch on my shoulder like this when I'm wearing like thick t-shirts. Like this is so thick. I can hardly feel her claws. And I mean, I don't know if you guys can see this, but my arm is completely scratched up. See that? It's really bad. And that's because she's still young and she's not secure uh, with her balance yet. So when she feels like she's gonna topple over, she'll <laughs> OMG. It feels like, honestly, it feels like a shark is, is eating me alive. But there are times when she is secure, like now, and, and the claws are not gripping, they're just lightly grasping. Mm -hmm. And when I do open palm like this, usually she's quite, it's flat footed, no claws, no nothing. But if I were to move too quickly and cause her to feel off balance, Oh my gosh, and it hurts so bad. So yeah, my arms are all cut up. Again, it just looks really questionable. Let's see if you can get a good look there. See that? Well, it's a good thing I ain't a model. <laughs> An arm model, you know what I'm saying? It's a good thing I'm not modeling wristbands for a living. <gasps> yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yes. Yes, yes, yes. OMG, my boy squad. My boy squad, you won't believe what she's doing right now. And I read about this. Lagaya is doing something that's really cool. Check it out. <laughs> 